Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Will Dodd with Georgia Youth Science and Technology Centers, and I'm going to show you how to use Tinkercad circuits. So we're going to make our first circuit uh, and we're going to program our first circuit. So what you need to do is on your Tinkercad dashboard, which is what I'm looking at right now, you're going to go to the left here where it says circuits and click there. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and create a new circuit. Now, when your little dashboard here pops up, you're going to see that you have all kinds of components on the right here. Uh, we're going to use those to make our first circuit, and we're going to make a basic LED circuit where we just use one LED and light it up. So I'm going to go ahead and grab an Arduino Uno board, and I'm also going to pull out a small breadboard. I'm now going to take an LED and connect it anywhere on the breadboard. But something that you want to keep in mind is that the LED has two terminals here. It's got an anode and it's got a cathode. The anode is where you want to hook up the positive lead uh, from your Arduino board. And then the cathode is where you want to hook up the negative lead. So that'll come into play in just a little bit here. Uh, I'm also going to want a resistor. I'm going to drag that out and just place it on the anode terminal. Now, uh, if you don't know much about breadboards, these vertical columns right here, they are all connected. So anything that I connect on one vertical column is actually going to be connected electronically. Uh, I'm going to rotate this resistor here by pressing R for rotate on my keyboard. Uh, and then I'm going to move it to here just so it's hooked up to that anode. I'm also going to click on the resistor and change the resistance value on it, if it'll let me here. There we go, resistance value. I'm gonna turn that to 220 ohms. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is just uh, a good number to use with your red LED. Uh, it tends to not blow the red LED when we're putting the, uh, the five volts from the Arduino into it. Um, and I have a lot of 220 ohm <laughs> resistors, so that's why we're gonna be using that. All right, so once we have this set up, I'm going to go ahead and connect some wires from my Arduino board into my breadboard. So first, I'm going to connect the ground wire. And I'm going to connect that to the cathode of the LED, which is the negative terminal. I'm going to turn the color of that wire to black. Because in general, when you're working with electronics, um, black wire signifies the negative terminal. Uh, on 11 here, pin 11, I'm going to hook a wire to that and then connect it to the positive terminal that leads through this resistor into my LED. And I'm going to turn that red because generally that's what's used in electronics to signify the positive uh, lead. So uh, that's, that's our circuit right there. In the next video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to program this circuit to light up for different amounts of times. But before I sign off, I'm going to go ahead and click up here on the title. And I am going to change that title or rename it to LED circuit. And it's not letting me type into that. So what I'm going to do is exit out of this, go back to my Tinkercad desktop. And when I get there, I'm going to click circuits again, and I can click this gear, and I can click properties, and I can change the name there. So I'm going to name it LED circuit. All right, so you have created your first circuit in Tinkercad circuits. So I'll see you in the next episode where I will show you how to program this circuit.